The iPhone 15 Pro and 15 Pro Max allows for ProRes log recording at up to 4K 60 frames per second. However, at that top rate, you do need an external drive, which I do have a separate video on this channel talking about some of our best drives for the 15 Pro and 15 Pro Max. However, this feature is actually disabled by default on the iPhone 15 and 15 Pro Max. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to turn on that feature as well as being able to toggle it on and off in the camera app. Hello everyone, my name's Mike and here at Sabrum we love to make and talk tech. So if that's what you're into, then make sure to hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you can stay updated with all our future videos. So without waiting any further, let's show you how to get into those settings. So first of all, you want to head to the settings app. Then you want to scroll down until you get to the camera section. You want to tap on that. Then you want to head to formats. You then want to scroll down and as you can see there is an option that says apple prores so show camera control for prores prores is one of the most popular formats for video professional post-production now it does have some guidance on how much memory it does actually take to record some of these and that is why we do recommend getting our external ssds in order to not fill up your phone's memory so what we want to do is we want to toggle that on and then where it says prores encoding we want to tap on that and we want to make sure that it's at the log format as it says here log is a video format that retains more information in the file, providing additional flexibility when editing, color, and making adjustments after the video is captured. Log will appear flat and gray before processing adjustments are made. Now we can exit out of the app and we can go into our camera app. And as you can see, we now have the option for ProRes Log. Now, in order to record ProRes Log in the 4K 60 frames per second option, you do need an external SSD. All the other formats work absolutely fine by recording it straight to the phone's memory. However, in that 4K 60 frames per second option, you do need an external hard drive. However, if you're gonna be recording in ProRes Log in pretty much any of the formats, I do recommend anyway using an external SSD because it is going to take up a lot of memory. So being able to offload that to an external SSD is gonna be absolutely fantastic. And also you're going to probably be editing it on your video editing uh, software of choice. So you may as well use an external SSD as it's going to be much easier and quicker to use. So this particular model has 256 gigabytes of storage. Some of it is being used. However, at the 4K 30 frames per second option, if we turn on the ProRes log option, as you can see, I can only record at a maximum time of 15 minutes. And if I wanted to record 4K 60 by just tapping on the 30 to change it to 60 as you can see i cannot record in the internal storage i have to use an external storage device but i wouldn't want to record in the internal storage anyway because if it's 4k 30 and it only allows me up to 15 minutes of record time then running at 4k 60 isn't going to give me any longer so no matter what like i said i do recommend using an external ssd to record but anyway that's it for today's video i hope you found this video helpful in order to enable the Apple ProRes log feature on your Apple iPhone 15 Pro or 15 Pro Max. And if you did enjoy it, then make sure to smash that like button and also hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you can stay updated with all our future videos. Anyway, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.